Hello everyone. So today I am here at Tulsi Resin Store, and we're gonna be learning what are different types of resin available in the store. So you all must know that resin is a chemical, and it always comes in two components. First is resin, and second is hardener. But the ratio of all these components change according to the variety of resin. So we have two is to one resin and three is to one resin at the store, and these are the most commonly used resin in the resin art. If you go in the market and search for art resin, you will get specific this ratios: two is to one and three is to one. As you use MC at your home, you always see that it comes in two parts: part A and part B, and we mix them together to make a solid form so that we can use it. Similarly, when we work with resin, it always comes in two parts: part A and part B, and we mix them together to make our lavishing project. Right. So we can mix our resin and hardener together to make a beautiful art piece. So today we'll be learning different types of resin and their ratios. So first of all, we'll be starting with the techniques of resin. So there are two basic techniques of resin: resin coating and resin casting. So whatever project you make in resin, they can be divided into these two categories. If either it is a resin casting or or else it is a resin coating. So what is resin casting and what is resin coating? So first of all, the resin casting, uh, resin coating is when you are covering a surface with resin coat, such as if we have this MDF base and we coat it uh, with resin, like we pour resin over it, then this is called resin coating technique because there is a surface and we are coating it with our chemicals and that is resin. That technique is called resin coating, but. But if you are making something completely out of resin, as you work with the ice at your homes, you cast ice in ice trays. Similarly, when we cast something completely out of resin, like these pieces are completely made of resin. When we use resin in silicon molds, that means it is resin cast. Because we cast a complete product out of our chemicals, our resin, and this is called resin casting. So these. Two are basically main techniques in resin, and according to which our resin is divided into different kind of resin. Because for resin coating or just for resin casting, different type of resin is used. So which resin is used for coating purpose? We have our epoxy resin, which is comes in two is to one pass and best for our coating products. It is mixed in the ratio of two is to one, so that is twenty grams of resin and ten gram of hardener for our coating purpose. Now, if you use this resin for silicone, then this is not. Uh, uh, you can use it for smaller casting like uh, coasters or bookmarks, molds. But this resin is not advisable for thick cast, such as your uh, flower preservation, river tables, or uh, tray, bigger trays. Thick cast is not advisable because the viscosity of this resin is thick so it may spoil your silicon molds with its viscosity and with its heatness that's why for casting we prefer our art epoxy resin this is an art epoxy tulsi resin it comes in the ratio of 3 to 1 and the viscosity of this resin is very low it feels like water it have very thin viscosity and so that's why it is very advisable for silicon molds you can make your river tables Flower preservation, thick cast. You can pour up to 10 mm in one go. But if you are casting it into a bigger cast, up to 50 mm, you can done. You can do it in layers. You can use this resin in silicon, in river tables, in bigger cast, in thicker cast. But you can use it for coating as well. But because of the viscosity of this resin is very thin, when you use it for purpose, you get a Thin layer of resin, you do not get a dome structure because of its viscosity. That's why this resin is perfect for our casting purpose, and epoxy resin is perfect for our coating purpose. Now both the things are done. We have epoxy resin for coating purpose and art epoxy for casting purpose. Now, what is this resin for? So this resin is again a two is to one resin. And this is a very thick viscosity resin. And what is the use for this resin? This resin is specially for geode artworks. As you can see, such pieces for these pieces you need a perfect 
measurements of face in perfect thickness to get the perfect lines, glitter lines, perfect pattern and you need a certain viscosity which is very thick like your sugar syrup. So that's the viscosity. This reason and it's perfect for geo artworks. You get the perfect lines of glitters, you perfect lines of the golden line and the base line. And this is a very shiny reason for your geo artworks. You can use it for top coat as well. You get a dome top coat of your resin. So that's the difference between these different types of resin. Again, I will be repeating. The 2 is to 1 epox resin is for our coating purpose. You can use it anything with the surface you can use this resin with. And now the art epoxy resin casting purpose in silicone molds. Whether the silicone molds are small or big, you can use this resin. For, you can use it for fever tables, you can use it for your coffee tables, flower preservation or anything of with the thick cast, you can use this resin. Now and for the geo artworks, where you want your piece to have that limited uh, artwork you need your resins to stay there where you pour it with the thick viscosity with the dome structure and with high gloss finishing you can use this resin all of our resins are very crystal clear they do not get yellow with the time yes if you expose them to sunlight over a long period of time you may seem a little pale in color but otherwise they are very glossy very shiny all the three ones are can be used for top coating can be used for uh, different artworks and the main specialty of these resins is what you can use it for any purpose if you cast this resin in silicone molds then also there is no issue but because of the thick viscosity this resin also have some bubbles so it is not advisable but your uh, resin will cure perfectly even in the casting so our resins are available in different packs this is a pack of 1.5 kg if you already work with resin and you need to work with in more quantity you can order this but if you are a beginner and you want to test the resin you can go for the smaller packs this comes in 300 grams similarly this is available for all of our resins the box resin is for 1.5 kg and 300 grams and the art epoxy resin because the ratio of this resin is 3 is to 1 this is divided into 1200 grams of this pack and this pack is in 300 grams so today we have covered different type of resin used for different artwork and if you are new to resin this video would be very helpful to you. If you are new to our channel do subscribe our channel and for more such videos you can write us in the comment section. All the reasons are available at our website tulsiresin.com and link will be given in the description below. So if you want to purchase that you can click on the link.